Hi everyone, I'm Frank from the City of Kings and today I'm going to be talking about the City of Kings and video gamers because I am a video gamer. I've played video games my whole life and when I set out to make the City of Kings the question I asked myself was can I make a video game a board game? I've spent the last 18 months trying to convert gaming mechanics from the video games that I've been playing into a physical form. Now, I love all types of games, but one of my favourites was RPGs, and I've been playing them for a long, long time. I used to play Final Fantasy VII, Final Fantasy VIII, Final Fantasy IX. I've spent hundreds of hours on Fantasy Star Online on the Dreamcast, all the way through to things like Guild Wars and World of Warcraft, which, as many people did, I played a little bit too much. So, why are you going to enjoy the City of Kings if you like video games? Lots of reasons, especially if you like MMORPGs, because you're going to be gaining experience points, you're going to be levelling up, you're going to be collecting items and exploring, doing quests, but more importantly, the combat system is based around the Holy Trinity. That means you're going to need a tank, a healer and DPS to make your way through the levels. So this is a really cool thing and something I really wanted in the game because I love the concept of tanking and healing and I don't just want it to be about attack something and it dies. You're going to have real strategy and some of our bosses are very much like raid bosses. They're going to give you that full experience of working out how to kill it, trying a few times and eventually conquering that enemy. So it's not just about the Holy Trinity. We also have professions. You can go fishing and what game would not be a game if it wasn't for fishing? I'm looking at you World of Warcraft, many hours of fishing down a Strangleform Vale, but you know what? I wanted to have fishing, I wanted to have um, wood collecting and ore collecting, so we've got several professions in the game and over time you're going to be able to gather different resources to trade for items and then build up structures. Now just as importantly, we've kind of got roles. And I say kind of because it's up to you about how you customise your character. You don't have to give yourself one role, but if you want to be a tank or a healer, if you want to be a professionalist or a worker as I refer to them, then you can. You can just do damage, you can do support, you can do area control. All of these options are available to you and you can customise your character however you wish. And how do you do that, you ask? Well, we have skill trees and I'm talking about a proper skill tree where as you level up you're going to get skill points to spend on that tree working your way up through the tiers getting different abilities on each tier. So true, the City of Kings is not a video game but there are many many things from video games in the City of Kings and we have tried to give you that experience and from our playtest so far if you were a fan of big MMORPGs then you're possibly going to enjoy the City of Kings a little bit more than you would expect. So, if you've got any questions at all, would like to know a little bit more about some of these topics, then feel free to ask in the comments below. And as always, until next time, keep on adventuring.